Hi YouTube, it's me, Wimpy. Um, so this is my first video that I'm talking on and the reason I am doing so is because as you may notice I'm not starting this drawing off with a blank page. I've already rough sketched uh, my harpy eagle and I uh, wanted to sort of explain what I did and why I'm starting from this point and not showing sort of the rough sketching of the form and the shape. I looked at a lot of images to try and do this drawing. It was sort of a challenge from uh, an old friend of mine from high school. Uh, him and his son really love the Harpy Eagle, so I'm trying to do up an oil canvas for them. Uh, and in doing so, I realized I should really make sure I do a few figure studies on this bird. So I started with the white of the wings. This bird has a very distinctive look underneath the wings with sort of this striped black and white wing feathers. So when I was drawing the bird, I started with the head, um, sort of placing the wings in a way that I, I wanted it to, to, to flow. Then I worked sort of down backwards towards the feet, um, just the way I felt would, would fill the page the best and most properly so that it would look, look really good. I started with the white when I was coloring it in. I, I highly recommend you always start with the lightest color and, and work your way to the darkest color. As I'm adding in the dark black to the bird, I'm trying to trace out sort of some of the heavy lines, some of the shading that I want to see in there. And I'm really focusing on just making sure that, that the piece is coming together in the right direction, which is why I sort of jump all over the page a bit. I focused here on the claw for a bit just to get that piece together so I knew that it was gripping uh, the stump the way I wanted it to do so. And I'm, I'm leaving the wings for the very, very end uh, as much as possible. I'm doing the undershadowing of the sort of the, the underbelly of the wing, uh, that part there, and then the tail wing here. So now I'm starting on the main, the main wings at the very top. These are a real dominant feature. They should look like they're closer to the viewer than the, than the wings that are further away. So I'm trying to give them a lot more definition, a lot more heavy lines to, to, to sort of just give that illusion. And then I'm you know, drawing in the little stump, just adding the final details, then smudging in sort of different, the blacks and the grays, just to blend everything together and give, give, the, give that tonage I'm looking for. Also, this is part of, of giving the, the bird definition in areas that I feel need to be more, more defined. I, uh, well, I hope everybody liked this, this video. Let me know in the comments if you want to hear me talking in the future or not. Uh, and please subscribe. Uh, lots more drawings coming. Lots more uh, fun projects. All right. Take care.